does, you need some gas. Oh. Yo. Oh, man. Good morning, everybody. Today, I'm going to go outside and do some truck stuff. Let me get ready. Put some old clothes on and uh, I'm going to go to my shop and surprise y'all quick. No, not really, but here's the beauty. She's look, she looks dirty right now, but anyway, let me show you what I'm doing. Stunt wall. Got them two hooked up. Waiting on my, I got six compressions coming. Got to finish wiring up. I'm waiting on the speaker wire. Should come in today or tomorrow. Hopefully it comes in today so I can do this video. I got this uh, 20, like 14 plus rear bumper. I need to put on today. So that's what we're going to be doing today, guys. We're going to be trying to get this wall done and putting this on for the truck. So, yeah. What up, y'all? Got some new boxes in. Let me show y'all my truck right quick. Finna freaking do a lot of stuff to it. It needs a... Not clear as fuck. What the? Fuck? Yeah, I need to clear, but it's dirty. I know. It's fuck. But, uh... This is her. She big. Kind of big. Show y'all this. Ooh, that powder. It's dirty. But I'm going to show y'all around. It's really dirty. Got a... Just put this in over bumper on speaker wall let me show y'all what i got got the compression drivers in i got this, some wire and got the horns and stuff for the compression driver we're gonna do three in the front three in the back so uh i'm finna start wiring this stuff up get this ready for pcb for the loud pack you already know. I still gotta give me a front bumper and color match all this. But uh, let's uh, let's get right into this. Depot on the B. Got my truck in here. Pop my hood. I got some Amazon wire. I'm gonna do three compressions in the front, three in the back. Got my hood popped. I'm gonna do them on my grill. Probably just gonna zip time in there. Oh well. It's gonna be a quick and easy job. Uh, as you can see, I'll show you what I got here. The TPTD250X, whatever the hook that is. That's what I got. The uh, 150 watt compression. I think they're one inch. Yeah, one inch exits. If I can get this open, bro. What the? Get my razor, bud. Ugh. It's gonna rip it. Ugh. Holy shit, dude. I didn't want this wire going nowhere. Uh, guys, uh, while you're here watching, click the like video, subscribe, comment down below what you want to see for future videos. You can see flawless whips. I gotta put my spike back on there, but I'm gonna get the wire. So what we're gonna do here is uh first we're probably just gonna bridge all three of them together. What the fuck is going on here? Holy shit. Shit's terrible. Alright, got that. What the f this one? Alright, anyways, I'm gonna go ahead and bridge these together. Let me get this down. Put this here. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna grab this wire. Alright, so also got these uh amp plug-ins to your wire. Makes it more simple and neat. What we're gonna do is we're gonna bridge three of them together. First of all, we need to find a way where we're putting these. Uh what do you think? I'm sure we put them. Uh I don't know, I'll probably have to take this off or go from underneath the bottom or something. We'll find a way. Oh, I could probably put them. Um, let me see. Oh, I could probably put them like that. Zip time up in there like that. I'll just, uh, I'm gonna take that bottom 
plastic piece off uh, in the motor bay. So I go in from the top instead of the bottom because it's going to be more hill at the bottom. But we'll probably just put them in the grill. My motor bay looks like a rat's nest, but don't worry about that. I got a lot of stuff to do with this truck. Mostly uh, freaking. I got a lot of work, but I'm going to do it all right if I can get this little piano. These little things I need a tool for. This little itty bitty flathead. Oh! Got some pliers. If I just pull this out, I got plenty of these pins just sitting everywhere, so I don't care if I mess it up or not. It should be good. Damn, that thing sucks. I got them wired up, so then I can just all run them to one cord. But I found a way. I'm gonna show y'all here in a second. I don't have a cameraman no more, so I have to kind of do what I can do without, you know. You know what I mean, but uh, I'm gonna get this saw in there and I'm gonna hook it up and show y'all. Got them in there. I just, they're all, these two are pretty much symmetrical. I gotta fix that one and uh, make it clean in there, but they're in there, sturdy. They won't move. So I got that. <clears throat> then uh, I gotta run the wire to the amp, make all these three go together. So this is a build, guys. So if it looks messy, like the truck itself, I gotta. I'm gonna redo. I'm redoing everything. You know, since I got it, it would look nothing like this. But gotta get a new paint job and whatnot. I mean, it's a, like a year old paint job, but it needs to be redone. But I'm gonna tie all these three together, and I'll be right back with y'all. I got one done. You know, we're gonna do it. I would heat shrink everything. We gotta do this set of cable. Now we gotta do is run it. Then boom, baby, that's that. Now we got both sides wired up. Now I just need to do some wire management, clean all this up, zip tie this up, and try to run it. Probably gonna run it through the firewall. That's probably what we're gonna do. But uh, let's get this done. So, all right. All right, I've done the front. Now I'm working on the back. Um, these are going under my truck instead of the speaker box because I'm ordering other kinds for my speaker box, but these are going underneath the truck. I might point uh, two on the side since I already got the speaker box. So it's going to come out 360 of the truck. So the fronts are done. I have to do wire management where all my amps and stuff are going to go. Hooked them up. They're pretty loud. But I'm going to do these underneath instead of the box. I'm going to get some more so I can just have 360 overall sound. So uh, I'm going to do this right quick and I'm going to show you all the uh, results. Some, uh, Jesus Christ, yes. I gotta grab some heat shrink out of my shop, so grab some of that. Let's see, a piece of this black right here to uh, for my speaker wire. Also, guys, uh, comment down below if you're going to PCB and uh. We're gonna turn, we're gonna be turned at PCB. I'm gonna let y'all know. Y'all already know I'm gonna be turned. You don't have the music. We're gonna be jigging. I gotta do a lot of wire management. But I'm gonna get up on here and uh, get this stuff done right quick. It won't take me long. Well, guys, I got everything installed. Um, cleaned her up also. So she's looking good now. Freaking real clean. Uh, I haven't fully done my wire management yet. I'm a, but uh like it's still good i have to run my walkie talkie wire whatever for my amp but i got it decent for now until I get time to fix it up but uh bumper zone all cleaned up ready for pcb but i guess i'll talk to y'all later and uh wait for another video there's my friend over there He's freaking being stupid <laughs> But, uh, he's laughing at me. Oh, cool. But, uh, yeah, we're getting, I'm gonna keep making videos and stuff. 
got it cleaned up. I got to shine out my tips. I got pictures tomorrow. Senior pictures. So I'm going to take them with my truck. So uh, I fixed my, fixed my spike caps. And I did get them uh, in the grill. The compression drivers. Freaking. So walk around in my truck. But uh, next video I'll show y'all where I got them located. So if it's just late, I'm ready to go in. Also, I got some crush lights. Crush likes for my folder today. We did good. Say peace.